today, I thought we could discuss uh, dementia, Alzheimer's, and Parkinson's, which are all uh, brain and nervous system disorders, and the way they interface with the autophagy aspect of fasting. So just before we get started, I want to mention a few places that you can pursue really good scientific outcome data um, on this subject, because obviously we're getting into serious illness here. And um, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a scientist, but I can direct you to that kind of information. So Dr. Rhonda Patrick, uh, the Department of Clinical Nutrition at the University of Hale. Um, my favorite is um, Dr. Sachin Panda at the Salk Institute, quite a prestigious organization. They have a tremendous amount of outcome data on this. And there's also, um, there's a laboratory, a neuroscience, neuroscience laboratory or a neuroscience lab at uh, the National Institute of Aging who have studied this specifically. So autophagy is the taking out old, diseased, degener degenerated cells and either um, rejuvenating them or clearing them uh, through, you know, getting, getting them out of the body and rejuvenating the body by replacing those cells with new, healthy, stronger cells. So this is the process of autophagy. Now, if we consider that for a moment, that this cellular regeneration, cellular rejuvenation does happen, there's tremendous overwhelming data that if you give the body more than six hours rest, the body will enter into, an, uh, in, enter into this process of autophagy. And if you give the body significant rest, so 16, 18 hours on water with, say, time-restricted feeding, or even better, getting into extended water fasting, two days, three days, five days, seven days, and beyond, then the body is just focusing, getting a lot of momentum and dy dynamic energy uh, in all these systems and processes which are required for this, this process of autophagy. So there's tremendous scientific data on this. Now, if we consider what is the brain? The brain is cells. The nervous system is cells. So just as in any other part of the body, this process of autophagy affects the cells in the brain, rejuvenates and regenerates the cells of the nervous system. So when we get into nervous system and brain disorders like dementia, like Alzheimer's and like Parkinson's, uh, this has shown to have a very powerful effect. Now, especially um, the neuroscience lab at the National Institute of Aging has very specifically studied these factors and has brought uh, outcome data specifically for Alzheimer's, dementia, and so on. It has a positive you could say healing effect or resolving effect for these issues has a very, if you're suffering or if you know someone who is suffering from these kind of diseases, they're so hurtful, they're so debilitating, and there is an answer. There is um, good scientific rigorous data that, that really has I don't want to say proves, but brings strong evidence to bear that water fasting has a powerful effect on improving these um, debilitating neuro neurological uh, illnesses. So I hope that's interesting for you. I hope that's intriguing for you. I hope that helps somebody out there. As always, um, I'm very grateful to be able to offer this kind of information. I hope it helps. Uh, please leave a comment, leave your experience. If you have any um, feedback or experience with this and, uh, and like and subscribe. Thank you.